Hi there guys and welcome to Naturally Awesome. I'm Eva and today I want to talk to you about why you should start growing your own sprouts. And I'll also show you how you can sprout them. Are you ready? Then let's listen to my 8 tips why you should start sprouting. When it comes to sprouting, there's nothing more locally grown than homegrown sprouts. And not only are they very environmental friendly, but they also contain a whole lot of health benefits. Sprouts are very nutrient dense and they purify your blood. Plus, they also strengthen your immune system. So here are my eight reasons why you should start sprouting at home. Reason number one, they're the best locally grown food. When you start growing your own sprouts, you're your own local organic farmer. Plus, you can also be sure that there are no harmful pesticides, chemicals or other additives in your food. Plus, you're helping the environment by leaving a very small footprint. Reason number two, they are super inexpensive. When you buy sprouts that are already sprouted in a health store, then it can be pretty pricey. So when you buy the unsprouted seeds and grow them yourself, you can get almost five to six times of the amount that you would get when you buy them already sprouted. So sprouts are a very inexpensive way to eat super healthy foods. So there is no excuse why you should not eat healthy foods, right? Reason number three, sprouts are very rich in enzymes. I bet you already heard of the superpowers of enzymes that we all need. And due to expert estimations, there can be up to 100 times more enzymes in sprouts than in any other uncooked fruits or vegetables. So you really want those enzymes because enzymes help you to break down your food effectively and that way you're absorbing way much more nutrients through your digestive tract. Therefore, enzymes are a very essential part of your digestion. Reason number four, sprouts are vitamin powerhouses. So if you want to get some healthy vitamins into your body, then go get some sprouts because during the sprouting process the vitamins in sprouts increase dramatically up to 20 times to its original value and especially when it comes to vitamin A, C, E and the B vitamins. For example, if you take mung beans, then research has shown that vitamin B1 increases up to 285%, vitamin B up to 515% and vitamin 3 or niacin up to 256%. Oh yeah, if you want to get vitamins, you definitely want to incorporate sprouts into your daily lifestyle. Reason number five, sprouts are very rich in proteins. And where do the vegans and vegetarians get their protein from? From plants. So with proteins, it's almost the same like with vitamins and anything else in sprouts. During the sprouting process, the protein in beans, nuts, seeds or grains improves and also increases the nutritional value of these foods. So that's another reason why vegans and vegetarians should eat more sprouts. Reason number six, sprouts are a very good source of essential fatty acids. Sprouts contain a great amount of omega-3 fats and this is also a fat that most people don't get in their daily nutrition. And omega-3 is very important because it decreases the amount 
of harmful cholesterol in your blood in your blood vessels and your arteries so if you want to keep your blood and arteries healthy then go eat some sprouts to get those healthy fatty acids into your body reason number seven sprouts are very high in fiber and as with anything else in the sprouts the fiber increases during the sprouting process so when they are grown they are very high in fiber and fiber is important because it binds fats and toxins in your body and helps to transport them out of your body plus they also ensure that the toxins and fats are not reabsorbed due to your intestinal tract so when it comes to weight loss you definitely want to eat more sprouts reason number eight sprouts are very alkalizing when your body gets too acidic it can lead to health problems like cancer diabetes or allergies and many more and by eating more alkaline foods you can keep your body healthy and alkaline and sprouts besides other raw fruits and vegetables are a very good way to get an alkaline body so go get some sprouts and actually there's another reason why you should start growing your own sprouts because they're super duper delicious so are you ready i want to know how you can start growing your own sprouts then let's head over to the kitchen and get started first of all take your sprouting seeds in my case i use mung bean sprouts because they're my current favorites but you can also use any other seeds like sunflower seeds pumpkin seeds chickpeas alfalfa or any other and then simply soak it in water overnight or at least for 12 hours and after that put it in a strainer and give it a quick rinse to wash off any dirt and then put it in a bowl and cover it with some foil and you can now put this aside and water it twice a day and after one to two days your sprouts are sprouted and ready for consumption and you can now put them on top of your smoothie bowls or sprinkle them on top of your salads or make a salad with sprouts so i hope you enjoyed this sprout delicious episode and if you liked it then give me your thumbs up and leave me your thoughts and comments below and if you want to follow me daily then you can also find me on facebook instagram and snapchat and the links are in the comments below so that's it for today and until next time remember keep it light and simple and as always naturally awesome see you next time have a nice day